where do you see our children? And I was watching this BET award and it was sickening mm. to watch what it is. I mean, it was crap. And I don't care if you don't like me anymore for saying it, but it's garbage. It's garbage. This woman talking about singing, you know, pull my pull my panties to the side or some nonsense like that. And y'all think that's music? It's sickening. And y'all need to do something about the music that they're showing at BET Awards. Mm. And I'm sorry, I'm going to rant off, but yeah, I when I heard when I saw the kind of crap that they're pushing out there, you know, and there's you know, and six people with a mic, oh, oh, and what, say something, sing something, <laughs> play something. <laughs> Anybody want to hear ho, oh, oh. ho? <laughs> the hell you doing with a mic? <laughs> it's ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> music. And y'all think we were looking funny in the 60s and 70s when oh. we were dressed and idiotic. But check the music we was coming out with. We looked funny and with clown and clown costumes and stuff, but no music was like that. That was a renaissance in, in so-called uh, melanated or capital music. Mm -hmm. But today, today, they, they're not teaching. They took the Yeah, Doc is frozen. You there? Yeah, this is Yeah. Yeah, you see me? Yeah. There's just one beat and it's a drum and somebody playing something over there, or y'all are sampling old music. Why don't you learn the old music, copy the old music, play something or write something that matches the old music you're sampling? Mm -hmm. Why do you think the only thing they want to push is this? It's a dumb down, it's dumbing you down. The, the real hip hoppers, they not they they're gone. Mm -hmm. The ones who are really were trying to keep the message going, keep the beat going, keep the true music going. That's very few. I like, I like the one uh, brother Black Black Dots music, um, and Cam um, Cam Cambada. Cambada. Yeah, I played that. That's the opening of my uh, of yeah. I played their music as the opening to my um, uh, to my last webinar, and it's going to be the dope. opening to this webinar. Dope, dope. See what I'm saying? Because they mm -hmm. got something to say. <clears throat> all this other crap and you, you're going to see these women slutting themselves on stage mm. I don't want to see you squat unless you're getting ready to have a baby mm. the hell is all that about I mean mm. ain't, you, ain't you all numb already to all of that nonsense you would think right like how much more wow. can we take of this nonsense but I'm just saying that is what tires your soul that's what that that music is soul destroying music mm -hmm. why you think they called Jeez. soul music soul music back in the day Facts. Because you were feeling it. Yeah. You fell in love with the music. How many mm. babies were born mm. listening to, to Barry White? Yeah. How many babies were born listening to uh, Isaac Hayes, mm. the Delphonics? Mm. That's when you were in love. We, we were talking a lot. We just love our women. We talk love to our women. Now we mm. want to call them bitches and hoes and, and the hoe. Now that's become part of our language. That's what yeah. you are. You a bitch and a hoe. What the hell? Come on. Doc going off, y'all. <laughs> Doc going off. Because Doc is a musician. Y'all don't a lot. Some of y'all don't know. Doc is a musician. So this this uh this, you know, this is close to his heart. Yeah, listen, you know, uh, listen, Earth Wind Fires, my friends, they're close. Drummer, the, the singer, the arranger. I knew uh I knew um Maurice White. I met him back in the day, fell in love with their music, listen to true music, you know, and, and, and get back to that, learn, pick up an instrument, mm -hmm. because that's what you call your spirit catcher. An instrument is a spirit catcher. When you play it, after it, the, the, the instrument resists you, it's the hardest thing to get. If you want to play bass, you got to toughen up your fingers yeah, yeah, yeah. and your hands got to get strong. And then you got to work through it, work through it until it becomes, and all of a sudden, as soon as you free yourself from it, it begins to give you all the beautiful music you want. Mm. But it traps you first, it enslaves you, and then frees you. That's what you have to do. You have to catch a spirit catcher. And some of the ones who are the lyricists, I'm hearing some monstrous lyricists from the old rappers, man, it was so good to listen to hip hop from back in the days until I think Tupac went crazy, started talking all kind of nonsense and, and uh, it really hurt me. But when you start wanting to party back in the days and 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 one of my 
old guitar player friends, uh, my, Nile Rogers. He had a song called Good Times. Mm. They sampled that bad boy and um, up in the Bronx and became super, super. Matter of fact, when they sampled Niles' music, that's when the big change took place and they went to court mm. and stated that since they weren't going to be taking black people playing musician music anymore, just the rappers, that they changed the laws of music in order for you to sample music. Oh, because okay. Before, you couldn't. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because um, Niles and them went to court on Sugar Hill. Mm. And that's what changed everything. Mm. Wow. And they just, just, they just destroyed music. And when I turned on the BET Awards, they, you know, every, <clears throat> oh, God almighty. I, I, I was, <laughs> It, you know, I couldn't take it. it. Was hurting my heart, and I was saying, I, I, I wanted to look at it because um, our niece, uh, um, my uh, the granddaughter, mm -hmm. was dancing with Lizzie, mm -hmm. and so we said we want to see her dance with Lizzie, mm -hmm. and she danced, saw her, and then after that, it it turned into this thing. I was saying it again, and then all of a sudden, somebody was outside in the in the in the, in the audience, and they said. Time to listen to the baddest music ever played. <laughs> <laughs> this woman came out, started singing, and the guy came out, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> and she's singing to me, thinking, and he says, ho. I'm saying, that's not the baddest music ever played by black people. Oh, man. <laughs> Man, Doc on one tonight, y'all. Doc is bad at the I'm state sorry. of. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, man. That that was the one. My wife told me say something about that, you know. Oh man, I'm just hurt. Uh, I'm just hurt. Let's get back on the point. Yeah, man. don't don't let it make you that bad. <laughs> it does. I'm furious when I start looking at our brothers and sisters talking this nonsense. What pissed me off is that they they, they, they flower it up. They they talk the nastiest shit. Women sluck themselves, and that's going to be free. That's you. You go, girl. No. That's nasty. And you're just training our young girls to be hoes. Mm -hmm. You've got Cardi B talking to the goddamn president. How the hell you have Cardi B as your representative? You done lost your mind. Mm. 